Understanding the phrase backstabbing in English. Hello everyone, and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're diving into a commonly used phrase in English, backstabbing. It's a term you might encounter in various contexts, and understanding its meaning can greatly enhance your comprehension of English conversations and literature. So, let's get started. The term, backstabbing, is a metaphorical expression used to describe the act of betraying someone who trusts you. It originates from the literal action of stabbing someone in the back, which is considered a cowardly and treacherous act. In modern usage, backstabbing refers to a figurative betrayal, where one harms someone else's reputation, trust, or standing through deceitful, disloyal, or underhanded tactics. To better understand backstabbing, let's look at some examples. 1. In the workplace, if an employee secretly takes credit for a colleague's work or spreads false rumors to get ahead, they are backstabbing their colleague. 2. In personal relationships, if a friend shares your secrets with others or speaks ill of you behind your back, they are backstabbing you. 3. In literature and media, characters who betray friends or allies for personal gain are often depicted as backstabbers. Now, let's practice using backstabbing in sentences. I can't believe she was backstabbing me by spreading false stories. His reputation for backstabbing made him an untrustworthy team member. The novel's villain is known for his backstabbing tactics to climb the social ladder. Understanding synonyms and antonyms can expand your vocabulary. Synonyms, betrayal, treachery, deceit, duplicity. Antonyms, loyalty, faithfulness, honesty, integrity. That's all about the phrase, backstabbing. Remember, it's a term that signifies betrayal and disloyalty, often used in various social and professional contexts. We hope this video has been informative and helpful in your journey to mastering English. Happy learning, and see you in our next video.